Happy Wednesday. I hope this weekly e-news finds you well. I've got two things I gotta tell you. First thing is this Sunday, March 3rd, we are calling it Fat Sunday. It is Transfiguration Sunday. It's also the last Sunday in the season after Epiphany before we head into the season of Lent. Yeah, I said it, Lent. It's coming. So um, on Fat Sunday, we're going to take some time and talk about Jesus' transformation that takes place before our very eyes, and can we stay awake for it? And then after worship, we'll have a time of pancakes and fellowship and beads and all kinds of fun stuff. We'll have our own little mini Mardi Gras, so to speak. The other thing that's also worth noting is on Sunday morning at 9.15, we have Sunday school for our children, and we're going to show them how the Ashes for Ash Wednesday are actually made with the previous year's palm branches. So if you, if you all are curious in how that all happens, come to Sunday school at 9.15, and then we have worship beginning at 10 a.m. this Sunday. Then, I said it, Lent, Ash Wednesday is the start of Lent, and that is on March 6th. So we have ashes to go from 1 to 4 p.m. I'll be out on Minnehaha um, with ashes, and if you wanted to come by on the street, and I'll make my way through the snow, and I'll give you some uh, the imposition of ashes on your forehead or on the back of your hand, and tell you that from dust you came and from dust you shall return, and that you are a beloved child of God. And then there's Fair Fall Express from 4 to 6 p.m. if you are looking for affordable groceries. And then at 6 p.m. we will have a soup supper followed by an Ash Wednesday service. There's lots of things coming up in the next few days. I hope you are well. I hope you're able to be shoveled out. I hope you are warm and comfortable. And please know that you are beloved and that God's light is with you. God's peace and blessings be upon you on this day. I hope to see you soon.